empowering, enlightening, enriching. All describe a small organization that has taken on big challenges to make big changes. Since 1984, the Fifth Ward Enrichment Program has helped shape the community by empowering inner city boys to become responsible and productive young men. My name is Darius Hollins and I'm in the Fifth Ward Enrichment Program. I go to Wheatley High School, but my future goals is to graduate from high school and graduate from college. The colleges I would wish to attend or Prairie View or either University of Houston downtown. The reason why I joined the Fifth Ward Enrichment Program because it's a very good program. It encounters and empowers your life to help you become responsible and also help out and give back to your community. I'm Furman Gaza with the Fifth Ward Enrichment Program. This neighborhood right here is the slums, basically. It's at the bottom of the pack. It hurts me to say that this is where most people begin and end their lives within a matter of years. So this, this is the place that I'm trying to get out of. And when I get out of here, I can't, I can't say I'm just going to be one of these big time people. But I'm big enough to say, hey, I was there. I got out of it. Activities for Fifth Ward Enrichment, you know, it's just so much we've done. You know, we've been to Branham, Texas, the Bluebell Factory. Um, we've been to Camp. We even went to D.C. How many people can say they had the opportunity to go to D.C. for free? My background. Wow, that's, um, that's something I don't like talking about, but... I have to let somebody know my story, you know. Other than the people that know me, I need somebody to just really know what I've been through. <sighs> Grew up with my grandma, you know. Been with her for 17 years. Mother abandoned me at the age of two months. My sister, age of, I think, I, I'd probably say a year. And, you know, my, my grandmother, that is my mother. That's the way I look at it. I don't have a mother, I have a grandmother. And, you know, like just... Growing up without a mom, you know, a father you'd expect you that's more that you hear about, that's more likely. But a mom's that's that's hurtful, you know. But the way I see it, she missed out on something good. She missed out on raising a child that'll bring out the inner good in her. You know, she missed out on being on somebody who's gonna be big one day. And um, I gotta tell you, growing up without a without both your parents, that's kinda tough. And um Wow. It's actually hurtful to grow up in a household household without your parents. You don't know me two, three, four years ago. I was immature, always getting into trouble, um, you know, always on people's nerves, but they helped me learn that all that playfulness, all that childishness wasn't going to get me anywhere. They helped me step, up, step my game up. They've helped me become a better person. They've helped me get my head on straight, my goals. They've helped me pursue those even more, made me want to gave me reason to believe I could go to college, reason to believe I can graduate and be something big, do something real with my life. Um, they gave me reason to believe that I can do just about anything I want to I, do. I'm actually, fifth one in Richmond, they made me happy, you know, better person. I think I, I made the right choice, and I think eventually everybody else will see that I also made the right choice.